Hello friends, welcome to Crackgate CSC and in this series of algorithm, today we will be discussing Floyd Warshall algorithms previous year get questions, right? So in the previous video, we have discussed everything about the Floyd Warshall algorithm that what is the time complexity, what is the space complexity and how you can solve a question using the Floyd Warshall algorithm which is a dynamic programming approach, right? So before starting this video, I would like to request you all if you have not subscribed to the channel till now please subscribe the channel and press the bell icon so that you can get an update whenever I am uploading any new video. So now let's start with the first question. The first question came in gate 2016. So the first question is the Floyd Warshall algorithm for all pair shortest path computation is based on which of these paradigms. So four paradigms are given. One was greedy. So we know that the Floyd Warshall algorithm does not depend on the greedy. It is not based on the greedy paradigm. It is based on the dynamic programming paradigm. So the right option, the right answer is dynamic programming paradigm, right? Because in greedy, we do not explore all the possibilities. Divide and conquer. We divide the problem into sub problem. Then we combine the solution. And in dynamic programming paradigm, we try to explore all the possibilities of a problem. So. This is what we was doing in the matrix form. We are trying to find out the path using the each and every vertex. So that's why it is a dynamic programming paradigm, right? Now the next question is that given below some algorithms and some algorithm design paradigms. So some algorithms are given and some algorithm design paradigms are given. So these are the four algorithms given. One is text or shortest path, Floyd Washer algorithm to compute all pair shortest path binary search on a sorted array backtracking search on a graph and these four are these five are the algorithm design paradigm that is divide and conquer dynamic programming greedy design depth first search it is depth first search and it is breadth first search that is b f s right so we have to match that what is the corresponding design paradigm so we have to match the above algorithm on the left to the Corresponding design pattern they follow. So this question came in gate 2014. These four options are given. So how to answer these kind of question? Always try to strike out the incorrect option. So how we can do it? See, check first Dextra shortest path. So we know that Dextra is the greedy design, right? Dextra is the greedy design approach, greedy approach. So first one third. So these three are having first with third. This is not first with third. So this is not an answer similarly go with the second one second one is floyd warshall algorithm to compute all pair shortest path so i already know that floyd warshall algorithm is to dynamic programming now check for the second one second one is dynamic programming in these two options that means second to third this is also wrong so only two options are available now now third one is binary search on a sorted array so this we have discussed in the second chapter of divide and conquer that binary search problem depends on the divide and conquer because we divide the particular array into two parts and then we perform the binary search recursively on each of the parts so we keep on dividing and then we conquer so that's why it is a divide and conquer so for third it is one so both are correct till now right for this backtracking search on a graph right backtracking search on a graph so you might have remembered that we have discussed the uh, sum of subset problem right in sum of subset problem we was having a subset and we was trying to search the sum from that particular problem so I explained to that using a tree that whenever we was going like this first we solve this then we backtrack came here then we backtrack came here then we backtrack came here so this is a kind of backtracking approach so here you can see that I am going to the depth first then I am going back, then again going to depth, then I am going back. So this is a depth first search approach. So this fourth one is related to the fourth one, right? This one. So the right answer is C, not D. So I only found these two questions based on the Floyd Washer algorithm. I haven't found any more questions in last 10 to 15 years. So in case if you are having any such questions, just let me know so that so that I can discuss that question also with you. So if you found this particular video useful, like this video, share it with your friends. Don't forget to mention your comments or feedback or suggestions in the comment box, right? And in case if you are having any query, any doubt regarding your preparation and regarding any subject, you can connect with me on my Facebook group and Facebook page. I will provide you the link in the description.
right and with this particular video we have completed the dynamic programming chapter and in the next videos we will be discussing hashing because hashing is a part of algorithm syllabus so we will be discussing hashing then we will discuss the tree travel so with that this playlist will going to be going to an end right so thank you very much for your support keep supporting keep learning have a great day